Hello my dear children, I am again welcoming you all on this channel and today I am going to present you module number 4 and because it is our day 4 of this bridge course and today's topic is paths of plants and photosynthesis and these are all my objectives. The first objective is to give you the information about the different parts of plants and their functions and the second objective is about the photosynthesis. So let's begin our video so that without wasting our time we can learn more in short time. Plant parts and their functions. Okay, In this figure just you can observe this picture and it is a very beautiful picture which I have taken from the Google images because it is I think it is more clear to you <clears throat> in this you can learn the different parts these are the roots and the, as you know the roots give support to the plant and always and also it absorb water and nutrients from the soil and give it to the plant to grow and these are the stem and these small one are the branches leaves these are the fruits and these are this is the fruit of this plant okay and these are the seeds means now if you start from here means if we start from seed seed produces a new plant because as you know I have taught you in the class fifth that seed has a baby plant inside it and when we put it in the inside the soil and give it water and sunlight it give rise to a new plant and this plant has these roots which is the underground part of the plant and these are the parts which are above the ground and in this the function of leaves is very important actually the function of all the parts are very important but the leaf has more important function because it gives and it produces food for the plant how it make food for the plant it uses sunlight chlorophyll to convert the carbon dioxide water to sugar and gives of water and oxygen okay this is the photosynthesis which uh, is going on in every green part of the plant then these are the flowers flowers they produce seeds because they and the flowers uh, when they convert into a fruit the fruit has seeds inside it because fruit is only a part which helps to protect the seeds inside it like this the fruits they are only the protective function and they also help in the seed dispersal and the stem what is the function of stem the stem gives support to all these parts of the plant okay means and it also transport water and nutrients so these are the functions which are given in this picture as well as the different parts of a plant and I think it is very easy to understand you if you draw it in your classroom uh, class copy it will be very beneficial for all of you. Now let's come to the second part of our um, today's module that is photosynthesis. In this I am going to give you a short definition of this. The definition of this is def uh, the process of making food with the help of carbon dioxide and water in the presence of sunlight in the plant is called photosynthesis. Okay, which I have already taught and give you and explain you in the above picture. And this is a small diagrammatic representation of the photosynthesis means water from the roots and carbon dioxide from the air, sunlight from the sun and they both consume, they both are used to form carbohydrates means which is the food form of a food and they give out oxygen and water again. Okay, this is our complete photosynthesis in short if you like to learn it, it will be very uh, convenient and will be very fruitful and important for your coming examination means if you learn this equation of photosynthesis it will give you a quick revision of this photosynthesis definition means carbon dioxide water in the presence of sunlight converts into sugar water and oxygen okay this is whole photosynthesis now what is your assignments today's assignment means you have to draw a diagram of any plant and label its parts and then second question is what do plants need to grow means what are the conditions uh, which a plant needs to grow okay and the third question is you have to label the parts of this figure 
which I have given you. It's, it is just similar like this, uh, the diagram. And uh, you can complete this and you will learn the different parts of her and you write the different functions of these parts also so that it will be a quick revision type for you and these are few fill in the blanks related to the above module like dash is the part of a plant which prepare food for the plant that I have told you leaves is the part second is dash absorb water minerals from the soil was roots fruit contains in it seeds a baby plant is called uh, a seed okay and dash is the most attractive part of the plant the flower is the most attractive part of the plant and in this way today's module is completed and i think you will enjoy it and if you like it share it with your friends and uh, kindly subscribe the channel also